This is a first look in sculpting inside a Blender 3.0. Hey, what's going on? My name's Al, and as you know, Blender 3.0 has officially launched. Super, super exciting. I've done a couple videos about 3.0 before. It's a big bummer that really no updates to sculpting, but I've already whined and moaned about that. Let's dive in, see if there's any differences. Blender 2.93. Point four. We're just going to drop in the normal sculpting sphere. I'm going to turn on my statistics so we can see the poly count. We're going to use clay strips. And in the past, I've done a circle test. So that works just fine. They've made lots of improvements in sculpting. So let's go ahead and add a multi-res modifier. And we're going to press subdivide. So now we're at 98,000. Essentially, every single face is being divided by four. Still very, very smooth. Let's check the undo because undo can be a little bit slow from my experience sculpting in Blender. So I'm gonna subdivide again. We're at almost 400,000 polygons. Things are still slow. The undo button is a little bit. On this initial stroke, it's like a little bit slow. It takes a half a second or so. Uh, so let's do something and then I'm gonna press undo right now. So yeah, about a half a second. Nothing too terrible, but still pretty smooth. Let's bump it up a notch. So we're at like 1 point something million, 1.5 million polygons. Okay, relatively smooth. You know what? I take it back. That was, <laughs> that was pretty janky. Um, let's try just a circle again. Ooh, that was like stuttering here in real time. I'm not sure what it picks up on the video. Uh, let's try and do my signature. So I'll go slow with my signature. Let's go fast like I would actually sign it. Okay, that felt pretty good. Nothing too crazy, but still. If I move around, do some sculpting, it's definitely a little slow. And undo seems to work fine on all the previous ones except the first one. Still, the first one takes literally about a second now. All right, let's subdivide once more. I don't think we're gonna get much further. Remember, this is still back in 2.93. Oh man, still working on subdividing. Took four or five seconds there. Now we're at 6.2 million. I would say this is not usable. Especially there, just trying to make a circle. Yeah, that's pretty terrible. I'd like to do my signature real quick. Whoa! It worked, but there was a big gap. That's enough of this. Let's close this. Open up Blender 3.0. There we go. So this is Blender 3.0. And I just downloaded this today. We're going to go to sculpting and essentially do the same thing. Let's add a same thing, multi-res. And let's subdivide. Get my... Uh, where is it? Did they change things? Looking for my poly count. Could have sworn there was like a little arrow. What am I missing? There we go. Statistics. 100,000. Let's subdivide that again. And now we're at almost 400,000. Okay, that was very smooth. Undo is very smooth, except that last one takes a little bit longer for whatever reason. Here's my signature. Things are good with 400,000. Go ahead and subdivide again. Now we're around 1.5 million. And here's a circle. Ooh. Still very smooth. Ooh, very nice. Okay, okay. That's cool. I really didn't expect this to work. Oh my gosh, that is super responsive. That's sweet. Okay, so this will be the real test. Subdivide, this should put it around 6 million, whatever it was. 6.2 million. Just thinking still takes uh, quite a bit of time to figure that out. 6.2 million. We're just going to do a circle. Ooh. Okay. That it was lagging, but that seemed to like, that was okay. That is definitely not nearly as bad. That's encouraging. That's awesome. Try my signature. So I'll have to put these up side by side and then we will be the judge of this, but this feels not as bad. I would say it's better. Maybe it's just a placebo thing. You be the judge. Cool. So let me know in the comments below, am I crazy? Uh, it feels like Blender 3.0 is a little bit more optimized. Things were run a little bit smoother when I have done that brief sculpting test. Let me know, is this just a placebo? Looking forward to doing more sculpting inside of Blender. 